out here again on another shed trip solo this time I drove up into the mountains I'm on one of my favorite elk units a place that I love a lot and I'm gonna see if I can find some elk sheds now I camp solo a decent amount of the time it can get a little airy but you get used to it there's nothing like a good fire to uh, keep you warm and keep you company oh I've had a lot of people asking for an update on this shed year so up till now I've found about 150 elk sheds give or take jeez fire get under control and I found about 50 deer sheds or so that's not enough antlers to uh, to get by on to make a living on um, but it's helped me selling those antlers has helped me to get a bankroll going that's allowed me to buy some antler and I've been able to make a few thousand dollars doing that I've also been lucky to work with Scree Gear uh, they're an awesome camel company and uh, they help me out a lot and give me a little bit of part-time money so financially I'll be honest it's not really there I mean there's not really that much cash flowing in I'm making a decent amount of money. I'm probably making what I was doing, doing janitor's wages. But there's different things that I've thought about doing that could bump this income up a little bit. Uh, one of which is going to be monetizing my YouTube. So I hope you guys don't hate me for putting ads on these videos. Um, I've actually been back and forth with it a lot. And I decided I'm going to do it. I'm going to pull the trigger on monetization. Basically, that'll give me a couple hundred dollars a month in ad revenue off of YouTube, but every little bit helps. I've been working with some awesome companies, awesome sponsorships. And as this blog goes on, I'm going to transition it more into a hunting blog. Um, the hunts are coming around. I'm hopefully going to have as many as seven tags this year. I'm going to be spending a lot of the bankroll that I've built up on tags and on opportunities to create content. So I've got some big things in the works. I've got a couple archery tags. I've got a muzzleloader tag and a couple rifle tags that I'm going to be doing. I'm really excited about that. I'm going to really step up my trail camera game this year. I'm going to be working with a cool company when it comes to trail cameras and have my hands on some of the newest technology. I'm pumped for that. I'm also going to be doing um, some exciting trips here in the future. I have one coming up like a month from now that I'm dying to tell you guys about, but I'm going to wait till it gets a little bit closer. I'm flying somewhere and doing something cool. So I hope you guys are enjoying this. I hope you'll keep watching it and I hope you'll keep listening to me ramble in order to get to the shed hunting and the hunting and the things that I'm doing. So stick with me. The shed year is just getting rolling. It's just getting popping and I'm so freaking excited about it. I'm so pumped to get out there and to have more adventures, to do more things. I mean, look at this. This is my life. This is my job. I'm in gorgeous country. I'm on the middle of a mountain. The wind's blowing through the quakies and the pines and I'm at work. So. There's, ha there's been highs and lows, there's been up and downs and all this, but I'm just blown away and totally grateful to be able to do this every single day. And I tell you guys a million times, it's because of you guys that I have the motivation to get up here and do it. And it's because of my wife that it's possible. But anyway, I love you guys. Keep watching, keep, keep hanging out, and uh, I promise I'm gonna bust my butt to make you guys some more content. So thank you so much for all the positive comments. Thank you for all the, uh, the messages on Instagram, the direct messages. Thank you for everybody who sold antler to support me. That's huge for me. Thank you to everybody who's offered to take me shed hunting, um, who's given me uh, feedback on how to do my YouTube better, editing help, advice. I mean, there's so many people that I could thank. I mean, I haven't really accomplished anything yet, but everybody's been so helpful and so supportive of me. So keep watching. And uh, now you've heard me ramble long enough once again.